fellow Tamarack members, and welcome to my backyard for episode three. Today we're going to talk about the pitch shot. The shot that I'm going to hit, just imagine you're on the first hole, just to the right, short of that right bunker, slightly in the rough. I need to hit a high, soft shot because the pin is cut right behind the bunker. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to grab my lofted club. With, for me, it's a 58 degree. Okay, we're going to set that club up so that my hands are pretty much in line with the ball and I want to be able to use the flange. I call feel the flange. You want to make sure that you swing it up, stand the club up a little bit on the backswing, and feel that club drop through the grass. So I'm going to set this up. My feet are slightly open. The ball is kind of up in the stance because you want to hit it up in the air. That naturally puts my hands in line with the ball or slightly behind. We do not want them way ahead. And we're going to stand this club up in the backswing and just stroke it through the rough. And right there, should drop in and land soft with not a lot of spin. This is about a 25 yard shot again on number one. Ryan, come on. Ryan's gonna show you a different approach. Hey, thanks Bob, nice shot there. For this pitch shot, you gotta imagine that we're on hole number, say 17, maybe 30 yards short of the green and the pins in the back. And when I try and follow through, I feel like I hold it off a little bit. This is to control trajectory. Bobby's finish was up here to go high. Mine is going to stay low to keep it down. The way that you can practice this is I have an alignment stick here. I'm going to put it underneath the grip. It's to the left of me as I practice my swing. I'm making sure that the alignment stick doesn't touch my body. Take that away. Go ahead and take a look at the pin and hit a nice low pitch. Great shot, Ryan. So hopefully you can take these tips out to the golf course. We look forward to seeing you out there. 